Okay, here's a situation. This is where you don't want users to use a specific browser, maybe Internet Explorer or the Tor browser or whatever, to be able to access a web application. You want to control the type of browser being used, maybe by version or by type. And then you also want to make sure they're not using an outdated version of the browser that might be unpatched and unsafe. This is where Microsoft Cloud App Security, our CASB product, comes into play. Let's check it out. Okay, so here I am inside Microsoft Cloud App Security, Microsoft's CASB product, and we have a policy here. It's an access policy that we created, and I just went over on the left side here to control and then policies to create it. It's an access control policy. Now, we have a filter being applied, so anytime somebody tries to access Slack or G Suite or SharePoint Online or Exchange Online or any of these web-based apps, and they're using a browser as opposed to mobile and desktop client, and the user agent string of that browser does not equal this. Now, this is the new Edge Chromium browser running this version. If it does not equal this, then block and apply a customized message and also create an alert and notify me. Now, I can add a few other things here, such as user agent tag. And uh, I can say something like they're using an outdated browser, or using an outdated operating system. And I'll talk more about native and robot in another video. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, just make sure this is updated. Now, we're going to switch over to Internet Explorer, and let's go out to outlook.office.com. Let's access our Outlook web app, our webmail. Notice when I go to that website, up here in the address bar, it's being proxied through Cloud App Security's session proxy capability. There is a domain cas.ms, so it's being proxied. And then I have this splash page that's displayed that says, you're using an unauthorized browser, contact the IT help desk for assistance. That's my custom message that we created, and my policy here is kicking in. How cool is this? Now, if I go back and I go to my alerts and cloud app security, here's the alerts, right? And then here's a new alert where we tried to access this, and uh, it was alerted. You could see that we were trying to sign in from Internet Explorer. There's user agent string and IE11, and it was blocked. How cool is that? And then I can correlate this to you know other alerts and see where they're logging in from and so on and so forth. Folks, this is amazing. I think this is pretty cool. We'll do another video on outdated browser version uh, later on and even that robot feature, but I wanted to show this to you because this was in direct response to a individual's question, an IT pro's question on LinkedIn. They hit me up and said, hey, how do I do this? I have a business requirement, cloud app security to the rescue, and this is how you do it. All right, folks, hope you found value in this video. If you have any questions, reach out to me on LinkedIn. If you have an idea for a new video, let me know. And by all means, stay happy, stay healthy, stay safe, and we'll see you in the next video. Take care.